Excellent results on crockery and cutlery are a must for any establishment where a meal is served. Customers will instantly be put off by a dirty knife or a smeary plate. Equally important is that items are free from bacteria that may lead to food poisoning. Correct use of the dishwasher will ensure these good results are always achieved. The Evans Vanadyne range of dishwashing products has been formulated to provide excellent results. Dishwash Multi for soft water, Dishwash for medium to hard water, and Dishwash Extra for very hard water. Rinse Aid Multi is for soft water, and Rinse Aid is for all water conditions. Before getting started, the wash-up area must be clean and tidy. Ensure that the area around the machine is clean, dry and free from debris. The waste bin must be empty and any work surfaces clear, cleaned and sanitised. Placing clean plates on a dirty surface could spread bacteria. The machine must be clean and working correctly. It is very important to check the detergent and rinse aid containers. They must have adequate product and the feed tubes must be in the solution. If the container is empty, then replace it with a new one. If you have a water softener, this must be kept topped up with salt. Ensure that the appropriate personal protective equipment is worn when changing these containers. When you have completed all the checks, switch on and fill up the machine. This may take a few minutes. Ensure the machine has heated up fully. Wash temperature should be between 55 and 60 degrees, and the rinse temperature should be 80 to 90 degrees. Advise your supervisor if these are not correct. If you are unsure about any area of dishwashing, you can always check the chart for information. When the dirty items are brought in for washing, it is important to separate and sort the items to avoid the possibility of breakages. Any leftover food or serviettes must be scraped from the place into the waste bin. This will help increase the efficiency of the dishwasher, avoid blocked jets, and reduce the frequency of changing the water. Rack the plates according to size, ensuring there is adequate space in between. Cutlery must be placed in a basket with the handle down. Cups must go upside down. Never place cutlery in with cups or crockery without using a basket. Use the spray above the sink to rinse off any residue from the plates and slide the rack into the machine. Now you can start the machine. During the washing session, occasionally check the levels of the chemicals and the feeder equipment. Wash your hands or gloves before touching any cleaned items and each time between loading and unloading the dishwasher. When the wash has finished, pull out the rack and check that all the items are clean. If required, return any unsatisfactory items to the dirty area for re-washing. Remove the clean items by the edges and carefully stack away. When the cutlery is dry, put it away, sorting it as you go. The wash water should be changed and the scrap basket emptied several times a day. This is best done during quieter times away from the main meal services. Empty the machine and when it is fully drained, switch off. Remove the filter, which can then be emptied and cleaned. The spray will remove most of the debris. Always replace the filter securely. Remove and clean the wash and rinse arms. Check the jets are clear from blockages and consult your supervisor if any jets are in need of replacement. Clean the inside and outside of the machine with a sanitizer or degreaser, making sure that you pay particular attention to the corners and channels around the edges.
All the surrounding surfaces should then be clean. Finally, sweep and mop the floor area. When you have finished cleaning, leave the machine door open and wash your hands. Evans Vanadine D scale should be used for the removal of lime scale. Scale buildup is one of the main causes of poor results from dishwashers. To descale the machine, firstly disconnect the detergent and rinse aid and refill the machine with clean, fresh water. Check the label and add the required amount of descale to the dishwasher. Run the machine through two to three cycles. Drain the water, then reconnect the detergent and rinse aid. The machine is now ready for use. Additional products are available for silver cleaning, starch removal and de-staining. A well-run and cared-for dishwasher will produce excellent results and happy customers. Training support literature is available free of charge upon request. For more information on the full range of Evans Vanadine products, please call or visit our website.